Also today, police fire officials got up early this morning to investigate a blaze at Victoria Gardens. Director of Fire Services Chief Superintendent Walter Evans told us that the department received a call around 6.30 this morning and upon arrival, officers met heavy smoke emanating from a three-story structure on the premises and discovered multiple fires at the facility. He told us that the fire officials were able to sustain the fire. The fire services director also confirmed that arson is suspected in this matter matter as an intense investigation is underway. Well, Chief Superintendent Evans also offering these safety tips for persons who remain in lockdown. During the lockdown, we know that a number of persons are home in large numbers, and so we want to really reassure them of the, the fire services presence, along with the Royal Bahamas Police Force. But one of the things we want to suggest to them is that they pay close attention to the utilization of the cooking facilities, particularly the stoves, because we know there will be an inordinate amount of cooking which will be taking place. Persons who, where, where you have children who will be made available, we know that electricity will also be used, and so we want to advise persons that if they have their homes and if they have any degree of from electrical shortages or any electrical challenges, seek the services of a certified electrician who would be able to correct any issues that they may have. In addition, we want to suggest to persons that what they need to do is wear their large amounts of children, ensure that they're always properly supervised, ensure that they pay attention to the Ministry of Education's virtual school classes, which are on, uh, on television, and also assist them with their homework and the school assignments, and not allow them to get into any mischief, such as things like playing with matches, things of that sort. And these are some of the basic things that we want to, to re ask the public to pay close attention to. So at the end of the day, we know that during this time, it's a very challenging time for all. But however, at the same time, we want persons to exercise safety at its highest proportion.